Hello my friends, welcome back to episode 19. It is time for Operation Compass. Which in theory should be simple enough, but uh, from what we saw last time it's actually not going to be that simple. Recon unit reporting. Flat cannon ready for duty. Hmm, okay. So we've got to get rid of these. There's also an anti aircraft gun here, which makes life uh, difficult. Recon units standing by. Obviously, in an ideal world, you'd want to use artillery to poke that anti-aircraft gun. But it's well protected. Anybody call for big boomers? So, what annoys me is there's just layers of protection. Tank squadron reporting. So you can't really get anything done that you would like to get done. Got a job for a tank? Anti-aircraft gun standing by. Got a job for a tank? Tank squadron reporting. Stand by for a bumpy ride. One thing that is kind of annoying is that... For the Empire! Your... So the experience system is what bothers me the most. Because... You get the most experience for killing the enemy. Or taking damage when attacking. We'll get it done. And the issue with that is... Like... Any orders for us? For example, if I use my cruiser, I'm going to take one damage because the cruiser has got light armor. It's so weird to me... That... At full speed. Taking one damage is... Hit him! the optimal move because I gain the 10 experience from being hit and you only need 100 EXP for each level any Whereas, orders for us you know the more the more optimal move of you know just steamrolling the enemy with a tank, tank squadron reporting um like this got a clear shot if he retreats Deader instead of dying doornail. I won't get any experience for it Orders confirmed. Target in sight. My armor's too heavy, he can't touch me. Guarding the Empire. We'll get it done. Obviously, this is a core unit, uh, non core unit, so there's really no benefit to damaging it. Tank ready for action. Adjust and aim. Save that for the combat record. Fire the main caliber. Yeah, so that's what bugs me, basically. Is this idea that... Uh, Anybody knows our survival chances? Boys, I don't think we'll be home before Christmas. This idea Cordon that is received. you can't... Um, Time to make some noise! You can't play in a sensible way if you want... You know, if you want... A good, soldiering life for me. experience. Raid party is here. Commandos. Can commandos paratroop? They totally can. And in fact, I guess they haven't got any transport. Into the paddy wagon. Into the paddy wagon. Stand by for now. God save the king. God, please don't be sentry You duty. can drop and attack all on the same time. Load turn. up, load up. Where do you need us? This is my other power. No, this is the Gurkhas. Gurkhas don't fly.
Mm, I'll move them later. His Majesty's own disappointment. Once I know where where is safe to push forward. So we know that we're on a tight timeline. I don't think attacking into this this turn is a good idea. I really need to clear out these aircraft first. <clears throat> Anybody call for big boomers? The whole area is just entirely too secure. Now you'll see some serious shite. We'll blow them to kingdom come. Is that totally secure? Tangent I think, positions! I think that's secure. AA battery is here, sir. This is nerve wracking. Flat cannon ready for duty. Do we get an escort? Wait, we don't? Okay. AA battery is here, sir. Order's clear. Let's move this one up. I think we'll have to wait for the Aye, enemy commander. to come to us. Be there in a jiffy. I can carry on softening up this bunker a little bit. Guarding the Empire. Probably going to have to use infantry to clean this out, to be fair. We're on the move again. We'll punch them full of holes. Where do you need us? Uh... Infantry on the move. Here in the rough would be fine. Ready to unload. Infantry standing by. Okay, here's my other paratroopers. Load up, load up. Fighter squadron is here. So I could you know, use overwatch busting and special abilities to get in there. But it just strikes me as a bad idea. Coordinates received. Fighter squadron ready for duty. We'll take point. Tactical bomber standing by. Ah, oh, am I out of the anti-aircraft gun range from there? Why am I not... It's interesting, why am I not being held to account for attacking that Any orders for us? Let's test Verifying it. Verifying the enemy's location. With a scout plane. It's weird how it just appears out of nowhere, but anyway. Okay, I was held to account there, so... Wow, they charged me 15 for that. It's really quite expensive. Ready to make some craters. Okay, now it's actually giving me the correct thing. That's so annoying that, you know, it has to be 100% identified or... Uh, Received. Heading there now. Or the game lies Loaded to you. Loaded to that brim. Moving to the new quadrant. We'll sneak up on them. Okay. Any orders for us? Attention! Ambush up ahead. Okay, he can't be... He can't be hit by this unless I shoot. But I'm going to shoot because if I take one damage... Fire! I gain 10 experience. You know, it's such, it's such a perverse Wait, experience. Wait, I see the enemy. In terms of leveling up. Deliberately taking fractional damage to level up. Strike hard, strike fast, no mercy. It's very odd to me. Making our way to new location. Okay. Anti aircraft gun standing by. Tank squadron reporting. Who is left? With fuel and ammo. Tank squadron reporting. 
this recon car. Any orders for us? And this cruiser. How many points do I generate per turn? 24, maximum 42. 22 plus 24 is 46. I'd lose four points if I don't carpet bomb somebody this turn. Uh, but I don't think it's worth it because I'm gonna get I'm gonna get billed for it unless I know there's no anti-aircraft around. We can always get them next turn. Making tracks. Let's send the uh, cruiser down the bottom. I guess it makes sense to stick the fast tanks down the bottom where there's no roads. Nobody will stay hidden for long. I'll use the auxiliaries to sweep along the bottom to protect protect my bottom uh, the bottom part of my my force as it moves along, and that way they're serving a good job, but they're also you know a vital role is being served, but they're also not taking my uh, any orders for us. They're not taking my experience. Officer approaching. What have you got? Anti-tank rifle, sappers, and transport. Okay. Ready for action, I think. Tommies are here. Oh, right. God save the king. The Gurkhas and the regulars. God, please don't be sentry duty. Where do you need us? You'll be wishing for sentry duty soon. Move, move, move! Okay, no forced march today. I think next turn I'll be able to force march and get in there. But I think this thing hits both... both soft and hard. There's really no way to avoid it. So my, my goal next turn will be... Firstly, hopefully these two planes just come flying in and, and, and enter the flak zone and get wrecked. With the Air Force eliminated, I should be able to then poke this anti-aircraft gun with something. If it has to be artillery or a scout car or something, I'll, I'll snipe it to switch the overwatch off. And then I'll carpet bomb this artillery piece into the ground. And that should allow me access. Meanwhile, I just have a wall here that just slowly... Not too slowly, because we're under a lot of time pressure to go across. Seems simple enough. Tactical bomber standing by. Oh yeah. Orders confirmed. Okay. Yeah, you walked straight into it. Get wrecked. Okay, that was pretty simple. And the anti-aircraft gun has gone ahead and hidden itself. Royal fighters standing by. Uh, we can use Overwatch Breakthrough and Afterburner. AA battery is here, sir. If I fired with that, I would then walk into the, uh... Apparently, I need to move to attack. I guess the angle is bad. Just say the word. No, not you. Home before Christmas. That's what they said. Open fire. Okay. There's no outmaneuvering us. Let's Overwatch break through the uh, the anti-aircraft gun. For the king, etc. It's not my it's not my Spitfire, so I won't cry too much. Okay, we got ambushed. We took the damage, but it was nothing major. Acknowledged. We are still allowed to attack. You know the rules, and so do I. 
know the rules, and so do I. Yes, Commander. Anti-aircraft gun standing by. Can you actually... Okay, it's not saying that I'll move this time. Blast it! Wait, they are fleeing? They are fleeing. Giving it all we've got. Send in the Spitfire. Very awkward to move to a particular... At times, very awkward to move to a particular time. On the move. There we go. Approaching target. Killing blow. Alright, got my 10 EXP for the kill. Anybody knows our survival chances? Those two flat guns are now... Anti-aircraft guns, standing by. Spent. Is he in range? He is in range. Blast it! Anybody knows our survival chances? Okay. We'll blow them to kingdom come! Right, so in theory, that anti-aircraft gun has now... Recon unit standing by. ...executed its overwatch and has no overwatches left. Uh, we can test that theory by... Uh, what is your order? ...ordering a bomber to bomb something. No. Not 100% the case. Ah, oh, that's annoying. He overwatched my, uh... uh... He doesn't have triple... Okay, he doesn't have triple attack, but he does have air defense. So he's got one more defense available. Guarding the Empire. I think the only way to deal with this fort, though, is carpet bombing. Fly fast, hit hard. Do I not have any other way? To Big give, caliber standing by. Give that guy a poke. I guess not, because this guy's got four range, which is the same as me. I would need to be here. I need an artillery piece here or here or even here. That's Royal possible. Artillery awaiting orders. I spy with my little eye. Hang on. Wait, I see the enemy. Okay, we've detected some fools. Yes, Commander. I think I can go there and hit that, and I'll be out of range. Any orders for us? It looks like there might be a way to... Orders confirmed. General Alexander. Wait to pick Tabrook to pick has a apart. large garrison and is well fortified. I suggest encircling the fortress rather than taking it head on. Knowing Italians, they might even surrender if we put enough pressure on them. To make this happen, we need to capture Bur El Gabi, <coughs> so Bur Hakim, and Gazala. Well, well, let's see what the Italians will break. And circle Tobruk, then proceed as you see fit. Okay. Royal artillery awaiting orders. We're rolling. Oh, yes. They'll hear this thing back in Manchester. Goal! What is your order? Commencing bombardment. They are fleeing the blast area. You know what's interesting? This is an airport, so the moment I capture it, I can just land my aircraft. Tommies are here. Right. That's great. On his majesty's service. On a bombing run. That means I can now carpet bomb this artillery. And all the support units that are here. 
on a bombing run. Double carpet bombing! Wow, I could do a triple carpet bomb! I've got so many points. Wow. Form up, form up. Do you guys want some free experience points? I was going to use these to clear the, uh... Home before Christmas, that's what they said. Yes, Commander. On it, Commander. I was going to use them to clear the, uh... Break down the hood! Uh, the guys in the city here. Okay, the paratroopers are still ready. I need to reconnoiter this area and. I need to reconnoiter this. Because if it's the mission objective is to surround this, then this might be quite undefended. And I can just sweep in and drop here to create the encirclement. No escaping us. Commencing bombardment. I lost the bomb. Do you have it? Payload delivered. Alright, stand by. Tactical bomber standing by. Keep calm and bomb the bad guy. Okay, it's infantry in there and it's infantry in there. Care package incoming. Tanks awaiting orders. Let's... Hmm. God save the king. I'd have to use one of my limited force marches. It's it's a bit weird that you can only use certain moves so many times on a mission rather than it being on a cooldown. Because it means the longer the mission is, the less valuable that becomes. But anyway. Making our way there. For king and country. It's usually difficult for infantry to pick up experience points, although I probably shouldn't concern myself with leveling up. A soldiering life for me. Uh certain units because uh, obviously I will um... alright let's get the snipers in there. open fire uh, I will at the end of this mission more likely than not buy the second level of the level up all your army perk which will be huge especially for units like artillery that struggle to gain experience points because of the way the system works Home before Christmas, that's what they said. Anti-aircraft gun standing by. God save the king. Right. Tanks awaiting orders. Should be able to hit that from there, right? Fire the main caliber. Good kill. Oh, no exp after. Uh, no exp after overrun. Sadly. Stand by for a bumpy ride. But I can just shoot this artillery, and I totally will. Hit him! Because artillery is a pain in the ass. It's just a shame that I'm not going to get any experience points for that. We'll get it done. Be there in a jiffy. Fire the main caliber! Run! That's the right idea! See, that's the most annoying thing of all. Is, uh... Say goodbye. I overrun. I, you know, I didn't quite do enough damage to kill that. 
Hit him! And, uh... Because of that... Orders confirmed. Um, I didn't get the EXP for it, and if I'd have used my overrun to get the EXP, I wouldn't we'll have... sneak uh, upon them. I wouldn't have gotten any EXP because of overrun. Ready to flatten some fools. The rules behind overrun. Stand by for a bumpy ride. This is a good opportunity for the cruiser to pick up some EXP, though. You know, once again, it's the same issue. If I kill that, I'll get 10 EXP for killing it. And the overrun. But then I'll lose out on the 10 EXP plus 4 for damaging this. But if I damage that first, I won't get the overrun. It's such a... Ready to flatten some fools. I don't know what the right word is. Say goodbye. Tedious. God in the Empire. The EXP system is quite... Recon units standing by. Unfriendly. Got a job for a tank? Hmm. Got a job for a tank? On His Majesty's service. Any orders for us? So yeah, that's... Open fire! Deader than a doornail. Guess I'll claim the, uh... The experience points for killing that. For the Empire! Let's get rid of the mines. Just an aim. Nice. Nobody will stay hidden for long. Attention. Ambush up ahead. Wow, that's a lot of stuff we just uncovered. That is that is a well fortified position. Target in sight. I'm pretty sure if I try and demine that, my mining crew is gonna, my demining crew, my sappers are gonna get blasted as an easy target by these, and this. Tanks awaiting orders. Adjust an aim. Our timing is always impeccable. Okay. There in a minute. Tank ready for action. Guess these regulars can just hang out back here. This cruiser can actually get right behind the enemy. Orders confirmed. Anti aircraft gun standing by. We'll punch them full of holes. Okay, this is anti tank gun. No problem. We're rolling here. out. I commander. Recon unit reporting. Actually, you can see. Earth like shakers are here. Let's keep this wall rolling forward. Just a big wall of metal. What I am gonna do. Here now, there in a minute. It it costs me points to uh to paratroop. Captured for king and country. But it also means that I can actually just get in here and get this airport. Infantry on the move. See, and once again, I'm here. Five rounds, rapid. Deliberately taking one damage so I can get the most EXP possible. Tactical bomber standing by. Now the whole team can get landed. The Royal Air Force is here. Keep calm and bomb the bad guy. As long as the enemy can't drive into your There's airport. There's no outmaneuvering us. 
It's a great place. Just say the word. To store your dudes. Okay, he doesn't have the... This guy doesn't have the special tactical retreat, so he can't actually... We'll get the troops where you need them! British commandos standing by. Alright, commandos. Any orders for us? The airport is in safe hands. Tank ready for action. Here now, there in a minute. Huh. I am not able to land on that tile. For some reason. Get him, boys, get him. Okay, well, I can just be really annoying with my snipers. We'll get them loaded back up into their aircraft. Keeping soon. the sky clear. If I need to start leapfrogging some anti aircraft forward. Anti aircraft guns standing by. Guns of the United Kingdom! Ready for action, I think. Order's clear. Ready to unload. Boys, I don't think we'll be home before Christmas. Yeah, let's just, uh... We'll rely on this anti-aircraft gun to provide cover while we move the two that are furthest back. Is it dangerous there? Forward. I will be very happy to get self-propelled anti-air. Standing by, Because it sir. seems like your, your ability to, um, organically move and undeploy in this game... British Commando standing by. ...is pretty poor. Wow, they could just destroy that from behind so easily. But I can't move them off of that tile because I've got all my planes landed there. And in theory, these tanks could go running down here into this position. God save the king. So I'll have to keep the surface area low. Making our way there. Got to keep the surface area uh, poor. God save the king. Okay, just double checking that. Got a job for a tank. Everyone. Everyone has taken their moves. Dude. <laughs> you're not, you're, you just, <laughs> you can't just fly around. Oh, he's going for it. Wow, they're bringing everything. That was the whole hog there. But that's a very inexpensive unit for General me to Alexander, replace. a great opportunity to get friendly with the locals has presented itself. I am all ears. According to my agent, the Italians are conducting a forced recruitment campaign, requisitioning Farage and pressing locals into frontline units. Requisitioning if you put Farage. An end to these what does that mean? <laughs> we will show ourselves to be liberators. Most of the Libyans can't stand their Italian oppressors already. A full-blown colonial revolt must be Mussolini's nightmare. Understood, Sir Stuart. We'll try to protect the locals. Okay. Yeah, this is... No ammo left. Wow, no ammo. They really put the boot in. But this is actually a repair tile. It will be a repair tile as soon as I capture the line of supply, which will be pretty easy. That fighter is going to be a pain in the ass, but... Enemy 
AA battery is here, sir. I think that this AA battery can, yeah, can hit him. Which means getting rid of this. Commander. There are definitely layers of getting things done here, but I think we just uh, obviously shoot down this bomber, clear this area, which then enables this area for resupply, then resupply this unit back up to full strength, and then work on smashing these tanks. Meanwhile, the bottom part of the front line can just push forward. We have five turns, because turn zero counts, apparently get over here and do that. So I guess we'll have to push hard. Push hard, push fast, no mercy. But yeah, a good start. Any orders for us? And the old frontline HQ recon car has gained 38 EXP already. I don't know what the maximum level is in this game. It might just go until... I mean, there's seven abilities there, so it might be seven, it might be five. Oh, current level, two of five. That answers that question. Okay, so the maximum level is five. Man, I reckon you could probably get a unit up to level five, like, in Norway, if you know how- if you exploit the EXP system. You could probably farm a unit up to uh, to that kind of level. Man, with five five choices, it's a decision of what you don't want. Enemy units surrender with one strength left instead of zero. I think, you know, as standard, these guys actually come with that. No? Hmm. I'd probably suggest that Ford Observer and Observant together would be the next step. The other three are kind of, you know, whatever. This is only useful one in three turns because it's nighttime one in three turns. And it only, you know, it's only attack penalty, which is not really why you use a recon car. One extra speed seems great, but recon cars are already very fast. So you were just kind of adding speed to a unit that most of the time doesn't need it. And then there's the possibility of making enemies surrender more easily. That's probably what I would go for after I've gotten forward observer and observant. This is not like the biggest bonus, but with the huge sight range of the scout, it would basically encompass your entire army. Anyway. That is it for now. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you guys next time.